is the 1993 Winnebago Itasca located here at Camping World Idaho Falls. I'm going to take you on a quick walk around. Okay. Some things I have noticed is it does have fraying on the awning. Um, over time, sun, wind does damage to it. That's just, that's inevitable. That's going to happen. Okay. But if you look at the sills around the windows, they're very, very, very well intact. It does have a hitch on the back, rated for 3,500 pounds with a seven-way plug. We'll climb up to the roof real fast here. Okay, we do have a broken light here on one of your running lights. But as you can see, there's no real indication of any serious tears or damage on the roof that we can see. As I climb back down, try not to make emotion signals too bad. We've got awnings over all the windows, but again, sills on the windows look pretty good, like they've been maintained by the previous owner. Now this is a consignment, so it is currently owned off, off site. Okay, you do have a little crack of a bumper. Keep in mind, it is a 1993. One step, screen door with the sliding latch. As we come in, I'm just gonna take you on a walk around and then I'll take you around the roof so you can see, or the ceiling, so you can see no water leaks. Okay, four burner stove, oven, just your traditional oven, microwave, cabinetry, you got your fridge, Okay, pillow top comfort mattress. I mean, this is, there's enough room for in there for a traditional queen. Okay, you got your hanging closets on both sides, but then you've got this big hanging closet here. Your bathroom, stand up shower with a ledge. So if you've got kids or grandkids that need to take a bath, you can have a little bit of one. Okay, while I'm in here, I'm going to take you around. As you can see, no signs of mold or, or cracking or, uh, excuse me, of, of water leaks. There's a slight crack in the tile there. But the closets are usually where you find the most. As you can hear, the restraints on these closets are still very, or very well intact. But usually on these corners of the roof is where you see the leaking happen. And the main reason that is, is because usually the most weight is happening on the sides of the coach. Vibration, torque as you go down the road. Now, I don't know what was there originally, but it's gone now. I don't even want to start to guess. But you can just see that the ceiling is very well intact. You got your captain seat, passenger, or your co-pilot, your pilot seat. This is a Chevy engine, so most likely a Freightliner chassis. 59,000 miles on it. At one point in time, or really within the last couple months, it was listed at 15995. It is now listed at 9995 plus you've got a, a prep fee. So you're right about right about 105 plus dock and title. Well, this is Nate at Camping World Idaho Falls. Uh, we have a lot of inventory here. So if this one doesn't work for you, you just let me know and we'll go from there. Thanks. Have a great day.